What up, world? It's Professor Reverb. Back checking in at Superbooth 2022 at Vostol Instruments. I'm here with Voxeloff. Well, what are we looking at here? We got the Soft Pop 2. Yeah. Uh, can you just tell our viewers basically what it is? Yeah, so Soft Pop is a semi modular synth. It's a desktop unit powered by USB, oscillator, filter, envelope, VCA, all the usual stuff, plus some extras. So uh, you can start the sequence. Here there is some like chord progression going on. There is some some like melodic material. So it has an eight-step sequencer. But what I think uh, brings the soft pop really to life are the scales or the quantizer. So I can just like pick. This is like a C minor scale I program. I can switch it to let's say B flat major or what it is. But I can also go and press few scales and to basically program a chord progression into it. So I like to think about the soft pop as a, like a sort of songwriter's yeah. synthesizer. So it's, it's ready to do, like, it's, a, it's really ready to work with chord progressions, but it's like really wild machine also. So you can, you can go to like really like... Yes. Like you can go to crazy town like really quick. And then, and then back to like melodic stuff. It's a collaboration with uh, Bastel and uh, Peter Edwards. He's an American maker, aka Casper Electronics. So we made this together. It's a follow up to the original soft pop, but this is like a whole new world. What's driving like basically like all the crazy sounds that we just heard? Like I understand there's like a lot of feedback synthesis that's like working in this, right? Yeah, yeah. So uh, at the core, it's like very simple architecture, oscillator into a filter into a VCA controlled by an envelope. Uh, but there are like few like feedback paths you can do. So uh, for instance, like the envelope is triggering, the envelope triggers a sample and hold circuit. And I can feed some of that randomness into the oscillator with this fader. And that basically adds some randomness to the melody. So that's one feedback path. Then you can control the filter with the envelope. That's kind of like very common. But then there is this pop parameter that basically cross modulates the oscillator and the filter. And you can get some, you can get like a lot more tonality from the filter this way. And it all goes to this like crazy. But there are like eight different waveforms. I really like this fractal triangle. Let's see it. So it's a triangle wave with some like very digital wave shaping, as you can hear. And this really comes to life when you play sequence and modulate the filter. Sure. So let's hear that. There is also like a lot harsher sounds, like this one, for instance. It can sound like really deep, so yeah. It's pretty slick. So I'm standing here and I notice a new module from you that I haven't seen before. Is this yeah. something new for Superbooth 2022? Exactly. That's like we're gonna want to get a get a shot of this one fresh. right here. So it's a it's a digital oscillator, uh -huh. uh, and it really uh, takes like everything good about synthesis. It can do FM. Nice. So you have like two operating oscillators. Yeah. One of them just goes into octaves. It can be also this octave lower. And then there is the ratio oscillator where you can get, get more like in harmonic, but you can also set all the ratios. That's pretty nice. So this is the pizza oscillator, right? Yeah, that's the okay. pizza oscillator. Um, yeah. What can we expect this out? So the pre-order is just launched. Nice. Uh, it goes for 245 euros without tax, so around 300 with tax, depending on where you live. 
Man, that's awesome. It's pretty exciting stuff. I really appreciate you talking with us. Um, I'm Fess. That's Vasilov. And this is Basto Instruments. Get your uh, new Basto pizza pre-ordered. Also, order your soft pop too at all Reverb stores. And uh, yeah, let's go check out some more Super Booth 22. Peace.